Last week, Ina Bonnet ran in the freezing cold with 24 other rape survivors. All she would say about the upcoming judgment in her ex-husband's trial was this. The end is in sight. The end is in sight. That end has finally come. On charge one, the murder of Conrad Bonnet, accused one and two are found guilty. Korte and his co-accused had tried to paint Bonnet as a liar who'd exaggerated the abuse she'd suffered, but the judge has totally rejected those claims. He's described her as a reliable and honest witness who did not contradict herself during more than four days of cross-examination. As the judge concluded his decision, Bonnet's friends told her, you can finally cry now. Once Kortz's best friend, Dirk van der Mavis says the ruling will bring closure to all the people whose lives Kortz has destroyed. He bucketed up my life for a year and, and my wife's life. And actually my, my marriage a little bit, but it's coming right now. Johan Kortzer and his co-accused all face a mandatory life sentence for the crimes they've been convicted of, unless they can convince Judge Bert Bam that there are compelling reasons why they shouldn't spend the rest of their lives in jail. Karen Morn, Pretoria. News that moves. ENCA.com.